This is a Braun Packset 35mm camera. It comes from uh, West Germany, as it was, and it was made in the 1950s. Very interesting design, and I might just be in love with this camera. Let's go have a look at the top panel first. Oops. This camera doesn't have a wind on knob. It has a reel that you can turn around here. Uh, we have the accessory shoe here. We have a frame counter and uh, the reminder dial on here that doesn't actually do anything, but you set it to tell you what film that you've put in. What is interesting though, is that it appears to have an additional focusing knob here for the rangefinder. I'll come back to that. If I look at the back of the camera, you can see that it has a very small viewfinder window and uh, the Made in Germany uh, logo on it. The bottom of the camera uh, has the camera release and the tripod and the front of the camera has the interesting parts. First of all we have the two windows which show us that it's a rangefinder camera. Uh, the, ca the shutter release is this knob here. The self timer is here. This appears to be jammed and I don't really want to force it. Uh, this socket here is for an electronic flash and if you look down there you can see the socket for the cable release. Okay, so uh, shutter speeds are set via this ring here and they go from, uh, well, they go from B, one second through to one three hundredth of a second. Interestingly, the aperture is set on the ring right at the front of the camera and that's quite awkward because you really need to set the aperture before you do the focusing because there's a tendency to turn both dials at once. It's not a coupled rangefinder in the sense a modern camera is. Uh, and to explain why we have this second uh, focusing deal, uh, dial here, you have to understand that this camera is actually interchangeable lenses. So if I unscrew here, I can take the lens off. Now this is a 35, uh, 39 by one mil thread, uh, Leica thread. So this lens will actually fit on a Leica camera. My understanding because of the distances is that it doesn't work the other way around. The camera will fit on a Leica, uh, but you're quite likely to damage it. So if we have a look at the Aperture ring. See here, it's very, very stiff. Okay, it goes down to that far. Okay, it's a leaf shutter. Uh, leaf shutters open, then close, unlike focal plane shutters uh, on SLRs or DSLRs. Uh, and this means that the flash will sink at any speed, and that's really quite useful. Let's put the lens back on. And the interchangeable lenses explain the second focusing dial because this one uh, will actually work for other lenses. This lens is a f2.8 45mm lens and these lenses from these cameras were very well made. Let's have a look inside. Unscrew it, unscrew it, unscrew. Now, on many cameras there would just be a flap, but on this camera the whole of the back comes apart. That means that there's no re real uh, chance of light creeping into the camera. We have a pressure plate on the back here <clears throat> but what that pressure plate does is not press against the film but this panel here. 
So if, when you load the film, you load the film from this end, hook it in there, you feed it across and you feed it through the slot in this take up reel, then you put this flap back. Then you reassemble the whole of the camera. This is something that is best done with practice. I will get it back in here. Thank you. And then screw it up again. So to use the camera, I turn it till I hear the, the shuttercock. I set my aperture first, then I set my shutter speed, and then I focus the camera. If you don't do it in that order, the focus will inevitably go off while you're doing the other things. Fire the camera, very quiet. It's actually a very small camera, but it's substantial. It's quite a, quite a, a, a weighty piece of kit. Uh, pack sets came in different versions. This would have been a sort of an intermediate version. The pack set super uh, would, would have a proper lever wind on it. The basic model didn't have interchangeable lenses. I've no idea what they cost when they were new. This was lent to me. I'd quite like not to give it back, but of course I will. So, the pack set from Braum. Lovely little machine.